Today we're talking about erectile dysfunction. But wait, before you change the channel, this could be an indicator that something else could be going on with your health. What is ED? ED is just another term for erectile dysfunction. And simply put, it's the inability to achieve and maintain an erection sufficient for penetration during intercourse. Approximately 50% of guys age 50 will have some component of erectile dysfunction. However, there can be much younger guys with psychogenic erectile dysfunction, think stage fright. But kind of the majority of men experiencing erectile dysfunction are middle-aged guys. Could this mean something else serious is happening? Yes, yeah, so consider this. Because the arteries that supply blood to the penis and the heart muscle are relatively the same diameter and size, if a man has an onset of erectile dysfunction, that may mean that in about three years, he may have a significant cardiac event, such as a heart attack. And so that's why it's important that if you're experiencing these symptoms, to come in for uh, evaluation. How does one talk to their partner about this? This is a partner issue. You may never know what your partner is experiencing or how willing they are to to, to help. They may be very willing to help you out and help you seek treatment that you need because if your partner's happy, so are you. So a healthy sex life is obtainable through treatment. It's, it seems like a, a very complex task, but it can be quite simple. Simplest maybe just taking a medication or maybe increasing exercise, improving your diet. It is Men's Health Month. It's June. What do you want to say to the men out there? As men, we really don't like to admit that there's anything wrong with us. And it's a very common theme in men's health overall is that we don't go to the physician. But this is a very easy, fixable thing, a very treatable thing, and it's not something that you need to be ashamed of. There are many men with this condition, and this is something that with just some discussion with your provider, we can find answers for. So if you need any more information, we made it easy for you. Just go to our website, ejgh.org. I'm Camille Whitworth. Thanks for watching.